back to Wise Wonders Kitchen Edition where we do STEM projects using only common household items. My name is Claire and today we're going to be making a model lawn together. Our lungs are super important organs found in our chest cavity that allow us to breathe. What happens is our diaphragm, a muscle located underneath our lungs, expands and opens up our chest cavity. When our chest cavity opens like that, our lungs are able to expand into that space and the pressure inside of our lungs decreases. That decrease in pressure causes air to be pulled into our bodies and into our lungs. Air starts its journey to our lungs through our nose or mouth when we inhale. It then passes by our pharynx or voice box and goes all the way through our trachea or windpipe all the way to our lungs where it goes through smaller and smaller branches till it gets to the very end of those tubes to little sacs called alveoli. And the alveoli are really important because that's where our blood and our lungs exchange oxygen and carbon dioxide. And we need oxygen in our blood in order to do all of the cool things that our bodies can do. Air really has a super long journey through our body. To build your model lung today, you will need one plastic bottle with the lid, two balloons, one straw, two rubber bands, a big pair of scissors, and adult supervision. The first step is to take your plastic bottle and your scissors, and you're gonna cut off this very end part of your plastic bottle. And you might need to ask for your parents' help for this part. The next thing you need to do is ask your mom or dad to put a hole about the size of your straw in the cap of your bottle. You could try using a hammer and nail, a drill, and sometimes even just a pair of scissors works pretty well. Your next step is to take your straw and fit it through the hole that your parents just made in that bottle cap. Just like that. Now you're going to choose one of your balloons and you're gonna stick the straw into the balloon. This balloon is gonna represent your lung. Now you just wanna secure that balloon to the straw using one of your rubber bands. Now you're gonna take this little cap straw balloon creation and stick it into the bottle that you cut in step one. So just take the balloon part, stick it through the top, and then screw the cap on. Next, you can pick up your scissors again and find your other balloon, and you're just gonna cut the neck off of this balloon. This balloon is gonna represent the diaphragm or that muscle that contracts to open up our chest cavity when we're breathing in. So you're gonna take your cut balloon, open it up, and then secure it onto the bottom part of our cut water bottle, um, and then you'll secure it with the rubber band. Now practice using your model lung by pulling on the diaphragm balloon and watching the lung balloon. Can you get it to inflate? Wow! <laughs> awesome job building everyone! I bet your model lungs look great. Did you know that there are people called biomedical engineers that make medical devices like artificial organs and replacement body parts? They are super important and really smart. You know what, I bet if you liked making a model lung today, you could even be a biomedical engineer someday too. In fact, I bet you could be whatever you wanted to be if you put your mind to it. Thanks for joining us today on Wise Wonders Kitchen Edition. I hope you loved making a model along with us. Please leave us any video suggestions or ideas in the comments below and we'll see you next time.